This video is sponsored by uPresenter, an AI-powered platform for interactive e-learning presentations and quizzes. Besides the clever AI assistant, uPresenter is unique in the AI market for the various built-in interactive questions and detailed report tracking ability. Sign up now and explore many other superior features of your presenter AI. What's up guys, welcome to another video on my channel. Supposing that you're editing video in Filmora 14 and your playback is super laggy. You cannot play the video, you cannot see the frame, anything like that. This video is for you, okay? So in this video, I will show you how to fix laggy issue in Filmora 14. You know, I've been editing video using Filmora for many years and produced more than 3,000 video and uploaded to YouTube and I know the software very well. Okay, so I'll show you some way to fix your lucky issue. But before we begin, the main problem of lucky issue is your computer. So if you have a computer that is not strong enough for editing video, it will, will cause lucky issue, okay? For example, if you want to edit Full HD video, you need to have a very good computer. If you want to edit 4K video, 5K, 6K or even 8K video, you need a super powerful computer. Okay. So in my case, I always edit Full HD video with 1080p and I think it's okay. The software is okay. For example, here's my example project. Okay. And we can mute the music and the sound. And when we play the video, you can see like this. See? So you see it is running. So the playhead is running smoothly. Okay? So tip number one. If you cannot play the video or the playback is choppy, you can reduce the preview quality. Okay? So go to the top of the preview window and reduce it to half quality or one for quality it's up to you but when you reduce the preview quality the video will look a little bit pixelated okay so it is not clear by the way we need to accept that okay so half and then we can play you see the playhead is moving smoothly so this is the first tip to reduce laggy in Filmora 14 and next one you see there is a red light on top of the timeline so if you cannot play the video, still cannot play the video, there is another option here. We use the render button. Okay, so re render preview. So you can just hit the render review and then you need to wait a few minutes because now the software will create a smaller version of the video so that you can play it smoothly. Okay, so I can hit the render button now and we need to wait if the video is very long and then you need to wait for a long time okay and you can see here on the left side it is green 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 so the green is dominating the red so after it finished then you can play the video smoothly okay i can click cancel now so now we have a green timeline here at this position mm -mm. and it is smooth right so that is the second way to fix the laggy issue in Filmora 14. And the next option is to disable hardware acceleration. So hardware acceleration is inside the reference in Filmora 14. Okay, so to do that, we can go to File and then select Preferences and see the Performance tab right here. So select the Performance tab and now you can disable it like this. So normally I would not enable hardware acceleration on my computer. I just use the software, so it is smooth for me, okay? So you can just disable it. If it is in green like this, like this, you can just click here, disable, okay? And click apply. So this is the third way to help you fix lucky issue in Filmora 14. And there is another option, but I seldom use it. That is the Prosify. If your video is 4K or 8K or maybe 12K, stuff like that, you want to create a Prosify so that you can edit it with a lower resolution. You can do it in Filmora also. For example, I have an image here or a video, anything, okay? We can just right click and select Create Prosify here. So just click it 
and now it will create a proxy file. There was there will be a signal here at the corner. So when you use this one, it is a lower version of the original media, and you can edit video faster and smoother. All right, so these are all the tips to fix lucky issue in Filmora 14. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you have any question, just let me know at the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more Filmora tips and tricks. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.